Okay, 10 second intro. We are going to a dollar store and selling things online to make money. The apps I am using, Profit Bandit for Amazon. You can also use the Amazon Seller app and the eBay app for eBay. There's a Facebook group below for everyone who wants to learn how to make money. Join that, it's free, it'll always be free. Let's go! First up is the toys section. All these toys are a dollar, it's the Dollar Tree, that's the whole thing they do here. These are pretty cool. Uh, they've got alligator or emoji or shark or fish designs on them. All of these are selling on eBay. There's no listings on Amazon for these yet. You can make one. I'm not going to do that. But on eBay, these are moving. Uh, you can look up, you know, the different designs or caricatures on them. Um, but they're all selling for around six bucks a piece. Not a lot of money, but you can flip it. We have more kind of toys. These are on the side wall of my Dollar Tree. I'm not going to mess with the Play-Doh. Uh, I looked up this brain teaser on the left, they'll sell okay sometimes, but the winner here is this tower game on the right. Sales rank is not great, uh, I wouldn't sell this for the lowest price right now, I would hold out for like 6-7 bucks, again not a huge money maker, but you can flip that. The big money makers, those are going to come to the end of the video because you know I gotta have that, uh, that engagement that YouTube wants. Next up are all these Arm & Hammer Fresh Shanshations. Uh, the stuff you put in your carpet, I think, and you vacuum it up, or something, who knows? They're all selling okay on eBay. Amazon, not the best. But what you want to do is lot these up by scent. If you lot them up, you'll save on shipping. Time for my favorite aisle, the candy aisle. Who doesn't love candy? I scanned a lot of these candies. They're all selling, uh, the ones that are profitable for about five or six bucks. Here's one that I thought you might like to see. It's the, uh, the Trolley Llamas. The, the Llamas, they're selling for uh, a small profit. Uh, I believe these are a uh, not a, a continually used mold, so the price is going to be a lot more variant than the typical worms. A quick note on those two, the sales rank is so low that I would hold out for like six bucks. I was surprised by this next one. I didn't think it would sell because it's a very well-known brand. It was Moon Pies though. These Moon Pies on Amazon are selling for a decent profit. Uh, this is a two pack, and what they mean is that it was it's two X of the boxes. There's six in each, so it's 12 cakes, two packages. No FBA listing, so we could dictate the price on that and charge probably $15. What I want to show you here is what you should be doing for everything you buy. Check the expiration date. A lot of these items are expired, and you don't want to sell that. The next item I've seen a lot of at Ollie's, it's a, a Duncan Hines. It's like a cake or a muffin in a cup. What you do is you put it in your mug, microwave it, and you got a cake. Some of these sell good, some of these don't. We're going to try to find the flavors that Amazon no longer stocks. So that first flavor is not profitable, but the second flavor you're going to see, Amazon doesn't stock this, and so we're going to be able to have a, a little bit higher price and make a small amount of money on that right there. Uh, I had to cut the screen because it took like 10 minutes to load. Bad Wi-Fi or bad cell service in these Dollar Trees sometimes. What you're seeing here is that someone is really undercutting it at like five bucks, that's too low. But someone's also going too high at $10, so we're gonna find a place right in the middle and make some money. Toothpaste companies are always experimenting with new flavors, new features, and if they don't sell well at, uh, at a mass market, then they get dumped at Dollar Trees. Then we buy them, sell them to the people who love them on eBay, and make a bunch of money. You want to sell these in lots because, one reason, the buyers are going to want a lot of them. And secondly, you'll save on shipping. Okay, the final one, the big shebang. The one that's selling for almost 12 times more on Amazon than in the Dollar Tree. Nope, it's not this glass stuff. It's over on the end cap. It's these right here. You put them on top of your pop can, it keeps them fizzy. That's not too crazy, but they have awesome uh, Pepsi and Mountain Dew branding. The Pepsi, profitable, but check this out. The Mountain Dew, selling for so much more money, almost $12. I bought them all. You should buy them all too, but don't take the price. Keep them at around 9 bucks. That's the video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. If you want to say some nasty shit, don't do that.